Hello, this is Miss Andrea. In a perfect school situation, um, instruction would lie somewhere between traditional schooling and homeschooling. This is a sponsored video. For example, history would be taught as a group class. Literature would be taught as a group class, but writing would be individual one-on-one. -on -one. Science would be taught uh, through group instruction and also very small groups for labs. And math would be a one-on-one -on -one endeavor. So um, the people from A Plus Interactive Math asked me to take a look at their curriculum. Um, they've recently redone it, updating it from back when we used Java and um, format it more for today. Um, right now it goes from elementary through pre-algebra, so that's roughly eighth grade. Um, they plan to have algebra back in the fall and hopefully they'll go beyond that. For my personal needs, my students are middle and high school and they're all pretty much around pre-algebra. So I'm going to give my opinion of this curriculum, but until they add more high school classes, I won't get a great deal of use out of it. You can see here that it's really complete, like seriously. It's set up for 31 weeks, which is a full school year. Um, the syllabus is on point, it has everything you need in the order you need it. So um, on a year schedule, when your student is um, done with it, you know, you write your completed dates, you print this out, you write your completed dates, and you file it. Um, in our case, we have three months to work with this curriculum, so we're just using it for review for homeschoolers. So, there's definitely a learning curve to learning the software. Um, my two students that I have on it, um, the older one has perfected it and is having no trouble. Um, the younger one, I'm going to need to sit with her and walk her through it because it's not exactly intuitive, but here's the thing. I don't think you should sit students in front of a computer and just say, have at it, especially when we're dealing with math. I think that we should sit with them and, um, make sure that they can work through it. And the only time we get up and walk away is when they are doing um, an exam.
So, now if you take the test and do however you're going to do on it, and I brushed through this and used a calculator, clearly I have fat finger syndrome. You can get a summary report that tells you what you did right and wrong. Well, it's not that great. So here's the exam I took real fast and, um, oh, I can go through it and view the solutions to tell me what I did right and wrong. A couple of them, I think it's an imperfect product. However, I haven't seen a math product that isn't an imperfect product. I think that this could be very stringent and I think it's a good product for a student working with a parent who's knowledgeable of math or a math tutor. Um, I wouldn't set a child in front of it and say, here, go for it. Um, but I wouldn't set a child in front of any math curriculum and say go for it. I really feel like the only time you should walk away from a child doing math is when they're taking their test. Um, you know, especially in this level of math, um, pre-algebra and lower. Um, Two halves. Each half is a fraction of the whole pizza. We can also say the fraction one half as one out of two, one over two, or one divided by two. So here's how I would use this right now because they're still working on it, they're updating it. I would use the video instructions. I would sit with the child, we'd watch the video instructions together. I would explain anything that they got, that they understood, that they didn't understand. Um, then we would walk through a worksheet together, um, do several lessons, whatever. And then when it's time for the test, at that point, I would walk away and let them take the test and then come back. And when they're done, review the test. Um, that's how one-on-one -on -one math should be taught. Um, too many homeschoolers are getting um, an interactive curriculum and thinking that the curriculum is going to do the job. You still need a teacher. So, so that's all I have for today. I wanted to introduce you to a plus to the soft.com and the a plus interactive math. Um, personally, um, just based on my feedback from my students and based on um, me going through it, th there are a couple of bugs to work out, but for a parent sitting with the student, um, it does a really good job. And I just hate to think of any parent sitting a child in front of math and letting the child do it on their own. Right now, they're offering a buy one year, get one year free, plus 10% off of a family package. Um, so it's not just for one child. If you buy it, it's for your family. And so you're basically getting two years for the price of one plus another 10% off. That means one student, if you have a one student plan, it's the $89.10 for two years. That's unheard of. That's unheard of in math. And if you have um, two students to 10 students, that's $134.10 for two years. So those prices are crazy. Um, I have a code that I will put in the comments that you can use. Um, that would be your referral code. I believe that is for the 10% off. This program does the grading and the tracking for you. And I'll, I'll show you an image of that. Um, 
they have chapter tests in the program. So after they've completed all the lessons in a particular chapter, then they would take the chapter test. Um, if the chapter test reveals any gaps, the student can go back to the lesson and relearn it and close that gap. That's the way an interactive math program should work. So like I said, the family package will let you teach 10 students. A family package includes eight different grade levels, first through six, plus pre-algebra. Um, they're working on the Algebra 1 right now, but Algebra 1 will be ready in the fall. It gives you an option to place each one of your students in the desired grade level and then even change the grade level as you need to, up or down. This curriculum includes video lessons, interactive review, practice worksheets, chapter tests, step-by-step -step solution to each problem, easy to read, progress reports, automatic grading and tracking, printable worksheets, chapter tests and lessons, and much more. Um, and includes some features that you can optimize to meet your specific needs. Plus they have printed material and you can buy um, pre-made um, workbooks and addendums to go with this. When you compare it to what's always been my favorite curriculum for younger kids, I think this is clearer. Um, I can't say this enough times, but I really feel like you all need to sit with your kids when they're doing the math. Um, too many of us think that we can just buy interactive math and sit the kids in front of it and they can do it and, and they absolutely cannot. So FYI, today was a pretty awesome day. Um, we had a meeting with someone from the city and we are getting closer to securing a location um, for our homeschool program where homeschoolers in our area can stop by on some days to hang out. On some days they can take classes that we've programmed on other days, they can offer classes in their specialties. And um, I plan to have a computer bank and tutors on hand to work one-on-one -on -one with students through their math. Um, and this will be one of the programs that I'm considering. Um, if you're considering it, please look down below for the information you need to check it out. Ask for a trial. Um, so that's all for today. Until next time.